Welcome, in front of me is a Pixel 7 Pro and today I'll show you how you can import contacts from your SIM card to the phone. So to get started, let's find our standalone contacts application. Oh, there we go. I'm gonna select allow. Um, now, right now it's showing contacts that are, I believe, associated with just the Google account that is signed in here. So, uh, to import new contacts, we'll go right here, fix and manage. Then we're gonna select import from SIM. This will display all the contacts that are on the SIM card. Uh, now, before you start importing, you have a couple options. So right here, as you can see, save to. You can change where the contacts will be saved. So we have two different uh, Google accounts that are logged into this device and also the device. Uh, so it's gonna show you all the Google accounts that you are logged into and obviously option for your device as well. So you can either import them to your account or to your phone. Keep in mind that if you decide to do it to the phone, uh, this will keep it only locally on the device, but if you do it to the cloud, meaning your Google account, these contacts will appear on every device that has this account signed in on it. From there, actually select device. From there, you can obviously edit which contacts get imported. By default, they are all selected, so you can uncheck some of them if you don't want all of them. Choose import. It gives you an option to keep or remove the contacts. That is completely up to you. I probably would urge you to select keep. Unless you're doing to the Google account, then I guess it doesn't really matter that much. It asks also if I want to back it up. No, sync off. Yep, keep off. So anyway, now that the contacts have been imported, if I go back, I should see them right here. After I switch to the device. And there we go. As you can see, there are the contacts that I have imported. Now, because I selected them to be imported to the device, I need to switch between, for instance, two different uh, options or three, uh, because they are separated between Google accounts and device contacts. So, with that being said, this is how you would import your contacts. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.